Hey, by pledge. To serve God in my life. Every morning in the heart of Karachi, hundreds of boys line up to pay tribute to the flag. It's a reminder of their duty to their country. At the Habib Public School, this is a tradition that has remained unchanged for half a century. The Habib Public School is celebrating its 50 years this year. It was um, a vision of the Habib family to have a school that would reflect the new aspirations of what Pakistan is and to have a school that evolves and grows with the country. Every great project starts with a dream. The dreamer is obsessed with his dream and asks his relatives and friends to join him. Habib Public School is the story of one such dreamer, Muhammad Ali Habib, and his vision of setting up an institution of excellence in Pakistan. The Habib Public School was set up mainly to cater to the middle class and low middle class boys and to give them an education which was affordable to them. As news of the school spread, classes filled up quickly. We started off with 41 students, but then the figures soon swelled into hundreds and into thousands. Now we have almost 2,000 students on our roll. Today, the school is divided into junior and senior sections and offers classes from grade 1 to 11. Students can sit either for O-levels or for the SSE exams, administered by the Aga Khan University Examination Board. The quality of the education can be gauged by the fact that in the last six years, 80% of the students have secured an A-grade in the SSE exams. These high achievers are a product of the school's approach to education, which fosters a love of learning from early on. It's show and tell day in class 5L, and Hamza Rafiq has brought in his pet turtle to meet his fellow students. This is my turtle, Spike. I've named him after his claws, which are exactly spiky. It eats everything which is green. For example, cabbage, beans, or even sometimes carrots, which are not totally green. We also put a lot of emphasis on the early education of the children. Even for classes one, two, and three, we do have a science lab and a music room also. The idea is to expose them right from the early stage to different things. For many children, this approach helps to channel their aspirations for the future. When I was small, I always used to see animals that were sick or wounded. So I started thinking that there must be someone who takes care of them. That is when I decided that I wanted to be a veterinary doctor. And then I thought that why don't I also open a zoo? To ensure a high standard of teaching, Habib Public School has its own teacher training centre where the staff is given refresher courses on a regular basis. A unique feature of Habib Public School is that it's one of the few full-day schools in the country. They wanted to have a full-day school, reflective of a similar program of public school system of the UK, in which the students were given full and complete education. The extended school day allows ample time for various aspects of school life, academics, sports and co-curricular activities. In Habib school, there are many, many co-curricular activities like gardening club, Urdu Literary Society, English Literary Society, and the Music Club, and all these clubs have a couple of hundred people in them. Taking part in co-curricular activities has helped many a Habibian shine. Bakhir Mehdi Rizvi was a shy little boy when he joined the school, but there's nothing like public speaking to instill confidence. This self-assured young man recently won a national debating championship. In the last competition, the topic which I got was, why do I love my school? The answer which I gave was, Kehte Shahzada Gautam Budh Gayaan ki talash mein apna takht o taaj thukra kar jangal o pahar o phirte rahe aur unko gayaan mila bhargat ke peed ki thandi chhaon mein. Main ek chhe saala bachcha apne walid sahab ki ungli tha mein Habib school ke sadr darwaze mein daakhil hua tha. Mera pehla padao, mera gayaan, mera Habib school hai. 